Hello, grade 8 learners. It's Antrop time for technology and livelihood education. I am Teacher Leo, and you are watching your favorite classroom right here on Dep Ed Zampin Educational TV. Believe, together we can. At the end of this lesson, you are expected to identify the entrepreneurial competencies, align entrepreneurial competencies according to business or career choice, and assess own personal entrepreneurial competency. Let us start with defining what entrepreneurial competency is. Entrepreneurial competencies refer to the important characteristics that should be possessed by an individual in order to perform entrepreneurial functions effectively. In this video lesson, you will learn some of the most important characteristics, attributes, lifestyle, skills, and traits of a successful entrepreneur in order to be successful in a chosen career. Are you ready? Let's begin with some of the few important characteristics, traits, attributes of a good entrepreneur. One of the important characteristics of a good entrepreneur is hard working. This means habitually working diligently for a long period of time. Hard working people keep on improving their performance to produce good products and or provide good services. Are you an industrious or a hard working person? Great. I believe the next trait is something you have. Entrepreneurs have confidence in one's ability and own judgment. They exhibit self-confidence to cope with all the risks of operating their own business. Successful entrepreneurs always stick on the plan and fight the temptation to do what is unimportant. This trait is what we call discipline. Are you a committed person? A good entrepreneur accepts full responsibility of everything in his or her business. He or she gives full commitment and solid dedication to make the business successful. Nothing is permanent but change. Change occurs frequently in all aspects of our life. When you own a business, you should cope up and thrive on changes. Capitalize on positive changes to make your business grow. An entrepreneur should be creative and innovative to stay in the business and to have an edge over other competitors. Are you proactive? Do you have an initiative? An entrepreneur takes the initiative. You must put yourself in a position where you are responsible for the failure or success of your business. Lastly, an entrepreneur enters the world of business to generate profit or additional income. This shall become the bread and butter for you and your family. Therefore, you must see to it that the business can generate income for sustainability. Now let's try to find out your personal entrepreneurial competencies. Please be guided with the following instructions. Get your personal entrepreneurial competency checklist from your capslet. Look at a screen for you to be guided. The checklist contains three columns. The first column is the personal entrepreneurial competencies of an entrepreneur. 
The second and third column are the personal assessment in terms of strengths and development areas. Let us start by assessing yourself by indicating a check mark in either strength or development areas column. Are you a hard working person? Do you have self confidence? Do you always stick to the plan? Do you have that solid dedication? Are you adaptable to change? Do you innovate to have edge over other competitors? Are you a profit-oriented person or someone who always looking for income-generating activity? Do you set your goals strategically? Do you have that effective and efficient communication skills and relation to people? Do you make wise decisions towards your goals and objectives? Wow! You did great in assessing yourself! Let us now interpret the result of your checklist. You will now total the number of check marks in each column. After accomplishing the checklist, choose someone you can talk to and share your insights and experiences why you came up with that personal assessment. Here are some guide questions for you to use in sharing your results from the assessment. Number one, what is the result of your assessment? Number two, do you have more strengths or areas for development? Number three, what do you think is the most important competencies you must possess to be successful in running your chosen business? Why? Let's find out what you got from our discussion. Identify the following personal entrepreneurial competencies. Write your answer on a separate sheet of paper. Here are the competencies to choose from. Creative, profit-oriented, discipline, Decision-making, people skill. Let us begin. Number one, an entrepreneur makes wise decisions towards the set objectives. The correct answer is decision-making. Number two, it means making some innovations to have the edge over other competitors. That's right, the correct answer is creative. Number three, an entrepreneur is skillful in record keeping and income generating activities. What's your answer this time? Correct, it's profit oriented. Number four, an entrepreneur always stick to the plan. Great, the answer is discipline. Number five, it means effective and efficient communication and relation to people. That's right, the correct answer is people skill. This has been another day of thinking, doing, and learning right here on your favorite educational TV. I am Teacher Leo saying, keep learning and improving yourself. Be an entrepreneur. Remember to always keep watching DepEd Educational TV. Believe, together, 
we can. Cree, junto, junto, puede. See you next time.